It's 2016, so any company must move fast in order to remain relevant. We need to work with vendors and tools that allow us to be able to achieve those goals. AWS is one of those vendors. I'm Alan Williams. I'm an enterprise architect at Autodesk. We're about 10,000 employees globally. We have a major office in the San Francisco Bay Area, but we also have offices all over the world. The reason we looked at AWS was because we wanted to be able to move faster. We wanted to not have those long capital expenditure discussions every single time we had a project. We wanted to be able to have a project and be able to spin up resources quickly. We started using AWS for very small sandbox use cases, and then that developed into more production use cases as we became more comfortable with the platform. Fast forward to today, we run full-fledged production workloads. We have hundreds of AWS accounts. We leverage IAM with SAML Federation to unify logging into the AWS console from one single identity, our on-premise Active Directory. That gives us insight and visibility into our entire landscape. When you have hundreds of accounts, that's a pretty complex environment. So we have dashboards. We can see who is logging into our accounts, how are they using our accounts. You now, any employee at Autodesk can use their Active Directory credentials to log into the AWS management console. We no longer use local IAM credentials, which means we know at any given time who can log into our accounts and who cannot. And we do that across all our accounts from one single pane of glass. AWS has made it really easy for us to be able to keep an eye on what our engineers are doing. How are they building applications? Being able to instrument that usage of the cloud. We have all that data centrally in Splunk via CloudTrail. We're able to leverage config to show us change management, and now we can actually see very easily what is being created, when, and how quickly. Automation is a requirement, it's not a feature. Automation allows us to build self-healing capabilities so that if a server fails, it recreates itself without causing any downtime to the application. That means that our services and applications can stay online much longer, we have less disruptions to our customers, and we're able to continue doing business. Moving to AWS has really been transformational for us, really because of speed. Speed is time, speed is money. Our projects no longer last years, they last months, which means that we can deliver new features and new services and new products to our customers much faster than we would before.